All right, what is going on, everybody? Welcome back to this Harold Johnson micro. And as you can see on the left of your screen, the playoff picture. We are currently one game out of the playoffs, one game out of the seven seed. We are 23 and 25 on the season. Uh, we've been playing a lot better ever since we made those trades, Lonzo Ball, and I literally forgot who else we got. But speaking of Lonzo Ball, we're going up against the Pelicans and our former teammate Darius Garland, who's actually been playing good for the Pelicans. Pelicans are the first seed, by the way, in the West. So I guess that trade worked out for them. JJ Redick, Brandon Ingram, this is the pre-trade deadline. So the team is basically the same. I'm not sure. Did I make the trade deadline? I didn't. Okay, so this is the original roster. So if we go to the stats, Harold's averaging 29 points, 11 rebounds, 7 assists, a steal, and a block, shooting 50, 40, 90. That is ridiculous. He is a rookie. He's already a 90 overall. Wow. Colin Sexton's having a good season. 20 points a game. Oh, yeah, we traded for Buddy Heald. All right. Buddy Heald's averaging 16. We also traded for Terrence Ross. I forgot. He's averaging 13. Jared Allen, 11 and 11 with two blocks. I forgot we also have IT. We now have IT on two of our uh, my careers. Didn't realize that. Um, Lonzo, 9 and 6. Um, Bielitsa, I guess, is on this team. I haven't looked at this roster in so long. So, yeah, I mean, I, I guess that's the roster. Are we past the trade deadline? Because... Uh, if we are not, I might trade Isaiah Thomas since I already have him on my um, core, um Cedric Lewis, my career. But nonetheless, let's just go up against the Pelicans and hopefully if we win, we can get into the playoff picture. All right, here we are in Cleveland for this matchup against the 30. 30 and 18 and you're first in the West. That, um, I don't know. I feel like if you're, you'd have a better record than that if you were first. Over the last five games, Alonso's been crazy good shooting wise. I don't know what he's averaging points-wise, but, you know, he's, he's playing pretty good, I guess. Um, But, yeah, if you're 30 and 18, that's first in the West. That's that's interesting. I don't know about that one, Chief. But we're going to be guarding Brandon Ingram in this game. Um, Larry Nance is going to be guarding Zion. If that doesn't go well, I will switch myself to Zion. But I have a feeling he will literally bully me because Harold, he's a KD build. He ain't strong. He ain't really meant for defense like that. But let's see if we can get this win. Hopefully Zion doesn't drop 60. All right, on the fast break, currently down two to four. Can I get a score here on Brandon Ingram? And no, I cannot, because I keep getting that stupid animation. Oh, I, I, I'm like 0 for 4 already to start. I can't get a shot. Apparently, Brandon Ingram is a lockdown defender. Larry Nance, that was the worst defensive switch I've ever seen. Wide open for three. Will I hit it? And it's a green. Thank you, 2K. Darius Garland's got 10 seconds left on the shot clock, trying to do something with it. Uh, looks like they ran a floppy route for Alexander Walker. King, come on, Sexton. You can play defense. That was good defense. Thank you. There we go. Uh, kick it out to Lonzo. Garland's there. I have, I have Walker on me. This is kind of a mismatch. Uh, whatchamacallit? Frickin' uh, Jared Allen. I don't know my own teammate's name. Had Zion on him. That was a weird-ass post fade away, but it went in. All right, I'm getting subbed out. Zion just got a frickin' and one. And we're down by five, dude. Oh, my God. I don't understand. Right by Brandon Ingram. Watch me somehow miss. See? I, I know it was a foul, but still. Animations, bro. Animations. Don't set the screen, Jared Allen. We got to get something going. Cut to the basket. Thank you. Oh, my God. Why do you take so long to cut to the goddamn basket? I don't understand. And now Garland's wide open. Yeah, just, just like when he was on the Cavs. Can't hit a shot. I don't understand why Jared Allen took so long to cut to the basket. He just stood there. Let's see, Larry Nance. Nope, you, you just didn't cut to the basket. What are you doing? Cut to the basket. Go, cut, cut. And it's going to be a charge. Cut to the basket. How does Brandon Ingram get his takeover? First of all, how is Brandon Ingram doing that? And second of all, how does he get his takeover after drawing a charge? He has a sharp... I don't, under, I don't understand. He has, he has a shot creating takeover. But when he draws the charge, he gets it. Makes sense. And then he dunks on me. Brandon Ingram. Yeah, I want to see him dunk on someone. Uh, not Zion. Lonzo, please hit this. Oh, dear Lord. Why is it every team I'm on, no one knows how to shoot? I it, does, it doesn't make sense to me. No one knows how to shoot. Every single my career, everyone sucks at shooting. It's either very early or it won't go in. One or the other. Uh, freaking, Why? Why? Now I got Zion on me. Zion is playing lockdown defense, mainly because I'm not doing anything. I'm going, okay, I guess I'm pulling up for the mid-range and easily missing somehow. 
This game is dog crap. Zion, once again, watch him hit this too. So close. He's hit that before. I don't know how that was only 25% contested. All right. I'm. Who's guarding me? Okay, it's Garland. Now I'm going to call an ISO because Garland is not going to be able to guard me. That is an easy and one. Thank you. And now we have the lead. All right, just grab my seventh. I should have passed it to Lonzo. No one damn. Yeah, you could have. You could have passed it to Lonzo, Colin, but you chose not to. I don't know why you chose not to, but you chose not to. Th come on. Thank you, Jared Allen. I finally get an assist, and he just murdered Brandon Ingram. Thank you. Zion back in the post. He takes it. Almost went in once again. That's eight rebounds now. I have my takeover. Let's see if I can actually use it. Um, I doubt it. Um, come set the screen. I'm a take. That's a bad shot. Yeah, I, I, that's a bad shot. I can't hit. No, you can't hit moving threes in this game. At least I can't for some reason. You see how small that meter was? And my three point shot is really good. My Harold is literally just a white KD. That's all he is. And for some reason, 2K is like, nah, nah, fam. Great defense, Jared Allen. You didn't ruin the switch. Uh, yeah, they're not faster than me, Colin. So if you were to pass that earlier, that would have been great. But no, let's pass it last second when Alexander Walker already caught up. I had freaking Steven Adams chasing me. I don't I don't understand why I have to spam for the ball. Give it. Okay, you're giving it to Lonzo? Throw up the lob. That should be easy. Thank you. Uh, Colin Sexton is the one that, you know, ruined it last place. So thank you, Lonzo, an actual point guard. Bro, all Zion does is literally just go into the post. All game. That's all his offense is, is just going into the post. I don't think that's how Zion plays in real life, 2K. Pretty sure Zion doesn't literally just go into the post every single possession. If any Pelicans fans can let... How does that even happen? I, I don't watch the Pelicans, nor do I watch Zion, but I would swear he... There's no way he just goes in the post every single freaking play. Oh, nice steal, Jared Allen. Uh, I am just going to... Uh, I... Didn't know Garland was right behind me. Sick. Awesome. Um, Jared Allen. There we go. That should be an easy bucket. I can only I can only get assists for my bigs because it's sometimes easy. I either throw a lob or they'll get open in the paint. Because my guards or my wings that I'm playing with, none of them, they, they can shoot stats-wise. But in-game, it's either very early or it just won't go in. We currently have an 8-point lead, and I now have 37 points, 10 rebounds, and 3 assists. Zion back in the post, and he's going to take that shot. 74% contested. Why does he only go into the post? I don't understand it. Lonzo, shoot it. Why do I have to force you to shoot? Man, he missed. No, that's why I have to force you to shoot it. I don't. Oh, boy. Oh, they got me out here with the bench unit and Jared Allen. That's interesting. Avery Bradley is on the Pelicans. Don't know how that happened, and IT just got bullied by him. So I get to play with Terrence Ross and Buddy Heald and Isaiah Thomas. All right, I'll take that. Does Buddy Buddy Heald has to have a floppy route in his plays, right? Right. How does Buddy Heald not have a floppy route? Oh, that's that's just blasphemy. How how does it not have flop? I need to add a floppy route to the playbook. Terrence Ross, that should be an easy bucket. Never mind that Zion. It's even easier and one. Brandon Ingram's got 25 points on only six missed shots and. Why do, I have, why do I have a center guarding me? Why do I have Jackson Hayes guarding me? That's not going to end well for you, New Orleans. But yeah, I can't guard Brandon Ingram. And it's not only me. I, I have been playing bad defense on him. But every time he a screen is set or there's a switch with a center, he doesn't switch. I don't understand it. He just doesn't switch. So Brandon Ingram just gets left wide open. Oh, guess what? I get to be guarding Zion in the post this time. 78% contested. That's that, I don't understand why that's the only shots he takes. Lonzo, it would have been easy if you actually took the shot, but that's a green bean. Get back. I get into the game. Back to a double-digit lead. Uh, I I just don't see... I see a pattern. That's what I was trying to say. I see a pattern here. Well, the Pelicans just cut it to three because... Oh, my God, is Brandon Ingram good. I'm going to kick it back out to Buddy Heel. This is the third time. All right, he's one for three so far. He, he Well, not on the game, like in that exact play. The first time, he drained it. No issue. Now, why is Ingram wide open? Why is the dude that is torching us wide open? But yeah, now that, that was the third time we ran that with Buddy Healed, And he, he missed. He missed back-to-back -back times. <laughs> Imagine if he hit both of those. I told you to fade. What are you doing, buddy? You're lucky I'm really good at basketball. Oh, my God. All right, I got, I got a center on me. I'm going to abuse this. 
I'm gonna abuse this. I promise you, I'm gonna abuse this. I didn't abuse it. Six point game in Zion cuts it to a four point game. Awesome! I'm one point away from 50. That's what I'm looking for. Yeah, I, I got. Do I have Brandon Ingram and Zion on me? Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised. Brandon Ingram has honestly been clamping me all game. Like, I don't understand. I can't score on him. And there we go. 51 points. And I extend it to a six point lead once again. And that's it. Brandon Ingram is gone. He picked up his, like, third charge of the game. We, we're already dominating. Like, we ran away with this game. And I have a triple-double. But Brandon Ingram fouls out. It's it's long over anyway. So, um, I guess I'll see you guys at the end of the game. All right, we're going to walk out of here with a 102-112 to 112 victory. I tried getting 60. But this game's awful. I literally missed a wide-open layup. Like, it was 2% covered. There was nowhere near me, and I missed it because this game's just all crap. But we end up winning. It was a close game. Well, it was a close game. But they, they just ended up not being able to stop me. Box score here right now. Harold, 57 points, 16 rebounds, and 10 assists. He had one block. 20 for 37 from the field. 5 of 11 from downtown. And 12 of 12 from the free throw line. I was getting to the line a lot. But he healed off the bench 13 points. He, he was a flame. A flame? A flame thrower. Um, he hit two threes. Um, I, he went two, I want to say, about two for five. When I was playing with him in that fourth quarter, so can I actually check? Yeah, he, exa he went exactly two for five, um, two for four from three. So you know what? I'll take it. I had we had those two plays. Um, Jared Allen, twelve points, eight rebounds, two blocks, didn't miss a shot. Isaac Coro, eight points, didn't miss a shot. Lonzo, and game. It terrible game. Terrence Ross, terrible game. Uh, Colin Sexton, you sucked. Uh, for the Pelicans, Brandon Ingram literally could not be stopped, but he did nothing but score basically. He had five rebounds, but. All he did was score. Jackson Hayes, all right, off the bench. Zion, he, he, he didn't do terrible, but that, it's Zion. He shouldn't be dropping 12 points. And they had absolutely no help at all. So that's going to be for me. Leave a like, guys, did enjoy. Subscribe, guys, are new. GG.